Brash high flyer who can do it all. Except shut up about it. Already quickly risen through the ranks of NXT. Never afraid to pick a fight, though there's no guarantee he'll actually fight fair. You can make friends or you can make money in this business. And Waller's gonna make a lot of money. Mello is money. I hate to pair it a catchphrase, but Mello really is money. Multiple title reigns and main events to his name already. And this guy is destined to continue that success in all of WWE. Time for Mello to make that money. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Championship. Introducing the challenger from Sydney, Australia, weighing in at 206 pounds, Grayson Waller. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, he is the Champion Carmelo Hayes. You can see it in the eyes of each individual. Only razor sharp focus when this much is on the line. A lot of people are labeling Carmelo Hayes as the future here in WWE. And Byron, I think they might be right. Carmelo Hayes came into WWE as a pure raw talent. And now that he's put some time in, you can see him getting better literally every week. The future is a long way off, but whatever it is, Carmelo's going in. Perhaps taking his first step toward true greatness this evening. And he's facing Grayson Waller, who, as much as I hate to admit it, might be as talented as he is arrogant. And he is very arrogant. It's called the Grayson Waller effect, Saxton. When he gets rolling and the cameras are on him, he just becomes a different breed of cat. High-flying power offense, he can and does do it all. Carmelo Hayes has a lot going for him tonight, Corey, but what does he have going against him? Overconfidence. Carmelo deservedly believes his own hype, but we know that can backfire too. Melo needs to keep his head in the game. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Right across the knee, heel oh. up locked in. This is painful. to be stretched that way. <laughs> Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. 
Oh, no. Ah, stop to the belly. Trying to get the Grayson Waller effect to spread through the crowd. Grayson now has a leg up in this match. And there's that overconfidence of Carmelo Hayes, which has backfired as he takes offense. And a right hand to the jaw, my goodness. The champ getting put to the test here. Carmelo's finally able to slow all that incoming offense. Carmelo was getting ground down, but could have just started a quick turnaround here. With precision. doesn't get much closer to three than that. Carmelo putting it all on the line. Up high! All oh, the way to the outside! It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Thinks he's something, huh? They are fading off the WWE fans now, pinning the arm down and oh, stop right to the hand. The referee counting, urging them to get in the ring and gets tossed back into the mat. Going right after the neck. neck from Grayson. What a... What a hand and then a somersault, but prettier! And I hope everyone had their cameras ready for that one. Man, Waller's a different breed. Well, I still don't like the guy. Oh, man! Ouch. A bad place to be for the challenger. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Climbing up to the top now. Misses! Waller playing to the crowd, trying to get him fired up. Buster! Mighty night. With a championship on the line! champion. I thought the defending champion had this well in hand, but the new champ had other plans. It just goes to show you anything can happen in WWE.